Cheer more in Baltimore as the road to the Final Four kicks off with the Colonial Athletic Association Men's Basketball Championship, March 6th through 9th at the Royal Farms Arena. A new money-saving fan package includes a room at your choice of hotels, two harbor passes, two admissions to the Power Play at Live Fan Fest, and an option to purchase discounted tickets for the championship. Come for the tourney and stay for the fun. Score your fan package today at Baltimore.org. had to endure yet another rugged winter. Maybe more coming right here around the city of Boston. But we get set for CA hoops to warm you up inside the legendary Matthews Arena. It's Delaware and Northeastern. Great to see you, everybody. Delighted you're here. This Northeastern squad, along with William and Mary and UNC Wilmington, who played. That's an excellent look. And that's crushed by Maurice Jeffers. Outstanding pass from Kyle Anderson. Delaware would love to have King Davis have a big game. Kasman has been really playing well lately, and you see Kasman Hayes there, you know, with the three. And so, congratulations. You know, he, he, could, he could, yeah, congratulations. To the Patriots. Anderson, good look at it. And stick it, he's drilled a three. Begley, the 6 4 freshman, who wears number 20 for Northeastern. Spencer got the roll. When Ford was out last year, Spencer played. He's he just riding that horse for all he's got. <laughs> Why not? Quincy Ford will splash that deep three. Six foot eight, but he can shoot it out there. Really has extended his range this year. Reggie, <laughs> Reggie. The Boston, <laughs> the Boston crowd knows all about that. And Maurice Jeffers just rocked that rim. Got a foul to go with it. His baseline screens. King Davis just threw it away. David Walker will attack the bucket. Got it. Ripped it away and then ran to the rim and finished. Well, these guards, uh, Walker and Williams. Monte Ross going to go to his bench again. We're going to see Barnett Harris wears number two. 6'9 sophomore. Off that screen roll, Maurice Jeffers has got another throw down. They ran that beautifully. Saw a screen roll with Holden and Jeffers. Devon Pinkard on the floor. Pinkard will unload. And you look at that front line of Zach Stahl with Quincy and Atherton, pretty effective. Holden got ripped by T.J. Williams, who ran to the rack and delivered it a quick four to tie it up for Northeastern. And, of course, prompted Monte Ross a moment ago to say, wait a minute now, Delaware needs to talk. And they come out and turn it over again. Walker will push with Williams. Strong finish at the rim. David Walker on the terrific bounce pass to T.J. Williams. Between them, kind of unnecessarily, as well as they've played, that's kind of been their problem. But Begley ran away from Anderson, and look at the levitation there. He came straight out of the attic. <laughs> he, he did. He came Kesman out of the rafters. Had three turnovers they forced that led to runouts, but Delaware has been able to respond. Anderson will sweet stroke the three, and Delaware is up seven to 47. I just got handed a stat. They're 14 for 23 from the line, and they're just coming up empty too often to, to win this game right now. They're normally about a 75% squad. And one coming for Corey Holden. He turned that corner and got it up and down off glass with a foul. I mean, these Northeastern students, they're not used to their basketball team doing anything but winning here. Oh, no. They, they, they've they did a lot of invitations to me over the years. How about the Look triple that. from Devon Begley as he dials long distance and Northeastern back to within three. Well, North well, I like that assessment, Blaine Taylor, as, uh, yeah, inside the four-minute mark. Chavarsky Corbin. T.J. Williams will secure and lead Northeastern on the burst out. Williams got contact. Put it down with one coming at the line. The bang, the bucket, and a trip to the stripe for T.J. Williams. This thing within a, a, a possession or two. And you called it. That defensive possession was the key. 12 points of the second half oh. for T.J. Williams. Trouble here. Corbett was able to 
find Holden, who gave it up to Maurice Jeffers for the big time throwdown. Bottom of the league. Well, I'll take Damian Lee, and I'll go play anywhere you want, anytime you want. And Boy, I'll feel good about myself. All right, this is Corey Holden now. Break it pressure. Kaz Mon Hayes with the punctuation mark on what is looks like it's going to be a Delaware win. Holden getting open. Holden catching the ball. Holden not turning it over. David Walker says, wait a minute, not so fast, as he'll bury a three to bring it back to a three-point game. Delaware was going to need to make them, and they've made a lot of them. Yeah, they have. With one second left, this is T.J. Williams, and Delaware's Blue Hens have come in to Matthews Arena and shocked Bill Cohen and the Northeastern Huskies. 73-68. to 68.